good morning and thank you for joining me at Online Storytime with the Pflugerville Public Library. My name is Miss Amanda and I'm one of the librarians here. Um, I'm so excited that you could join us today and just as a reminder, just like in-person story time, online story time is meant to be enjoyed with kiddos and grown-ups together. That way you can learn all the songs and rhymes and you can keep singing them all week long. So let's get started by singing The More We Get Together. I'm going to sing it two times, so if you don't know the words, that's okay. You can listen to it this first time and then sing with me the second time. Here we go. The more we get together, 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 the more we get together, the happier we'll be. When your friends are my friends and my friends are your friends, the more we get together, the happier we'll be. The more we get together, 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 the more we get together, the happier we'll be. When your friends are my friends and my So, today we are going to sing some songs and read a book about food. One of my favorite things about this time of year is that there are so many yummy foods to eat. There's turkey and casseroles, and you can get peppermint flavored everything, which is amazing. But before you eat dessert, like peppermint candy canes, you have to eat all of your food groups. So we're gonna talk about those food groups today. We're gonna look at a My Plate chart. Grownups, if you didn't know, you can go to choosemyplate.gov and you can download coloring sheets and all sorts of fun stuff for your little ones so they can learn about eating healthy. So let's look at the, some of the things we need to make sure we have on our, our plates at meals to stay healthy. We need to have lots and lots of vegetables, nice healthy vegetables. We also need lots of grains. We need some fruit, we need some protein, and we need to have a little bit of dairy every day to keep our bones strong. And next, we're gonna play a little game to see if you can figure out what food category these things are. So let me see which one I wanna do first. Let's start with this one. Here's a little block of cheese. Which one do you think cheese is? Is cheese a fruit? or dairy? If you guessed dairy, you're right. Good job. Let's try another one. Here we have a loaf of bread. Now is a loaf of bread protein or grains? If you said grains, you've got it right. Next up. Oh, I've got a tough one. This one's tough. Almonds. Are almonds a vegetable or a protein? That one's a tough one, but they are actually protein. They give you lots of um, good protein in your diet to keep you strong and healthy and give you strong muscles. Next up. <gasps> We have broccoli. I love broccoli. When it's cooked or when it's fresh and crunchy, it's so good. So, is broccoli a vegetable or a fruit? It's a vegetable. Good. Next, we have a banana. Mmm, bananas are really good. Are bananas dairy or fruit? If you guessed fruit, you got it right. Now we'll go through a few more and I'll tell you what they are. We've got eggs are protein, yogurt are dairy, cereal is grains, and a strawberry is, you guessed it, it's fruit. Good job. Let's get started with our first book. Well, today we are going to read Chew Chew Gulp. It's written by Lauren Thompson and illustrated by Jarrett J. Krizowska. You might know that illustrator if you have an older brother or sister that likes the Lunch Lady books. He's the one that writes those books and illustrates them. But before we get started reading the book, I wanted to show you. This book is very well loved. It's one of my very favorite books at the library. And so I want to show you what happens sometimes when we have a very well loved book. Sometimes 
you get little tears in the pages and you can see this one's been fixed right here. Now accidents happen. We always want to be careful with our library books, but when a book gets very, very well loved, sometimes little tears happen and that's okay. But remember, you don't want to fix the books at home because we have special staff here that are trained to fix books and we have special book tape for fixing them. So we can get them fixed to look almost as good as new. So you always want to remember not to fix it at home, but you can leave a note tucked into the book to let us know if there's a torn page. So after story time today, I'm going to send this one to the experts here at the library so they can repair it. Let's get started reading our book. Choo Choo Gulp. Eating isn't hard to do. Follow us, we'll show you. Swirl it, curl it. Here's mashed potatoes and spaghetti. Scoop it, loop it. Pudding, licorice. Prod it, pop it. Tomato, popcorn. Chew, chew, go. Mmm, pancakes. Sip it, nip it. Milk, green beans. Pick it, lick it. Grapes and ice cream. Nibble it, crumble it. Bread and cookies. Jab, jab, poke, sausage. Munch it, crunch it. Apple, carrot. Chomp it, chop it. Corn on the cob and banana. And I want you to remember that banana because we're gonna sing a little song later about that banana. Gobble it, guzzle it. Hot dog, juice. Slurp, slurp, burp, soup. Easy as pie. Now you try. So if you enjoyed Choo Choo Gulp by Lauren Thompson, you can put this on reserve at the library and we'll make it available again as soon as it gets repaired by the book experts. Um, thank you so much to uh, Simon and Schuster for giving us permission to share this book with you today. Now next, we're going to sing a song. I'm going to my ukulele out, and we're going to sing a song called Apples and Bananas. For this song, we need to practice our vowels. Now let's see, I've got some vowels with me today. We've got A, E, I, O, and U. When we sing this song, we're going to switch the vowels in apples and bananas. Use all of these letters. So the first time we sing it, we sing it like this. I want to eat, eat, eat apples and bananas. But after that verse, we start switching. So we're going to eight apples and bananas with a long A. And then we're gonna use a long E to eat apples and bananas. Then we're going to eight apples and bananas, oat, opals and bananas, and my very favorite one, we're going to oot, oopled and bananas. So we'll start off slow and then we'll speed up as we go along. All right, here we go. I like to eat. Next, you guys, we're gonna eat apples and bananas. Are you ready? We'll go a little bit faster. I like to eat, eat, eat apples and bananas. I like to eat, eat, eat apples and bananas. I like to eat, eat, eat apples and bananas. I like to eat, eat, eat apples and bananas. We're 
going to eat Ebles and Meninis. Here we go. I like to eat, eat, eat Ebles and Meninis. I like to eat, eat, eat Ebles and Meninis. I like to eat, eat, eat Ebles and Meninis. I like to eat, eat, eat Ebles and Meninis. I like to I, 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 I eat and bananas. I like to I. Which words? <laughs> I like to oh 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 and no nos. I like to oh 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 and no nos. Last one. I like to oh 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 and no nos. I like to oh 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 and no nos. I like to oh 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 and no nos. I like to oh 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 and no nos. I like to oh 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 and news. Yay! So I love that song. It's so much fun. So I want you to try to think of some other foods that you can switch the vowels in and try playing with the sounds of your words. All right, for our next song, this one's most fun if you stand up. You can do it sitting down, but I think it's more fun if you do it standing up. This is called Bananas Unite. Here we go. Bananas Unite! Pick bananas, pick, pick bananas, pick bananas, pick, pick bananas. Peel bananas, peel, peel bananas, peel bananas, peel, peel bananas. Next, we're going to chop bananas, chop, chop bananas, chop bananas, chop, chop bananas, mash bananas. Mash, mash bananas, mash bananas, mash, mash bananas. And next we get to eat bananas, eat, eat bananas, eat bananas, eat, eat bananas. Go bananas! Yay! Good job! Well, I hope that you've had fun at story time today. It's almost time to say goodbye, but I wanted to show you a couple more books that you can put reser on reserve at the library and check out. So we've got LMNOPs by Keith Baker that takes you through the whole alphabet. It's very fun. And we've got But I Don't Eat Ants, written by Dan Marvin and illustrated by Kelly Fry. These two books are so much fun, and I love this book here about this anteater that doesn't eat ants. So you can put those on reserve in the catalog and then pick them up curbside at the library. For your craft today, you get to make a fun candy cane decoration. So it's pretty easy. You're gonna get this bag that has a picture of what it will look like and little circles, red and white. And all you need is some glue stick and you just glue your circles together and that makes your candy cane easy and fun. Thank you so much for joining me at Storytime today. I had a lot of fun singing these songs with you, especially Bananas Unite. I hope you've seen that one at home. It's so much fun. Let's sing our goodbye song. Can you guys give me a big wave? Good. Goodbye, goodbye, I'll see you soon. See you soon, see you soon. Goodbye, goodbye, I'll see you soon. On another day. See you next time.